please understand the construction here the core meaning of the sentence very much ends here that the tallest free standing structure of the ancient world is the great pyramid of khufu and then what follows is some extra information about khufu so see from here to here this is one quality of khufu talked about and from here to here there is one more quality of khufu talked about and what follows is something about this extraordinary height since we are talking about the qualities of a noun these two parts of the sentence need to be noun modifiers so we need something that can directly modify khufu here to understand this better let's flip the sentence here is a simplified flipped version of the sentence so now you see from here to here this is a modifying phrase which is supposed to modify khufu so what do you think should come here collectively standing at 147 feet tall standing here is a present participle acting as a noun modifier so standing is perfectly all right try stands collectively stands at 147 feet tall khufu that doesn't make sense collectively stood at 147 feet tall doesn't make sense and this changes the tense also so one more flaw here collectively it stood at 147 feet tall khufu doesn't make sense in correct tense also and then the usage of a subject here it makes it a clause so in that case this would not be a modifying phrase here so answer choice d has many mistakes this is probably the worst of the five answer choices and then collectively is standing is wordy and awkward we have a better answer choice in standing standing here is a present participle acting as a noun modifier and the broad meaning turns out that collectively standing at 1 47 feet tall khufu is the tallest free standing structure of the ancient world and the broad meaning turns out that collectively standing at 147 feet tall khufu is the tallest free standing structure of the ancient world a is the correct answer choice